Hello everybody and welcome to Romance Falls Tarot. I'm about to begin here with a reading. Now this is a general reading so it might not resonate with everybody. It really is important and you please do take whatever does resonate with you and simply leave the rest of it aside. Now if you do have any questions whatsoever you would like to contact me please do so. You can find all of my information right below into the YouTube description box. So might it be for a question, might it be for a reading, everything is right there. So please do not hesitate. It will be my great pleasure. Also, if you have not yet subscribed to the channel and you do enjoy the channel, please do take a brief moment of your time to click onto the subscribe button to show your support to the channel and to myself. And it is always and greatly appreciated. And I do Thank you so very much. Now, that being said, I want to take a brief moment. I want to thank every single one of my subscribers. I thank you for being there. I thank you for listening, for sharing, for commenting. Um, and I also want to uh, thank all of the subscribers who have donated so generously to the channel. Um, much appreciation and much gratitude. I do thank you so very much. So with no further ado, let's begin this reading. These are messages that are coming from your angels and your archangels, and they are destined to you today. So I have base chakra. I have clear yourself, listen to intuitive feelings, and vacuum away fear. So let's start this off with the base chakra. This is about you choosing only positive thoughts to describe your home, your career, your finances. Why? Because your words, they determine your outcome. Now this message by your angels are indicating that you are focused onto your material needs, uh, such as desiring more money. And it is absolutely imperative that you use only positive words and phrases to describe your current situation. You need to affirm your desires as already being a reality and to avoid worry or any discussion that just kind of casts you as a, as a victim role. So the base chakra is also uh, called the root chakra. It's located at the bottom of your spinal column. And it is that energy center that governs your feelings about your material needs. So to open up your flow of divine manifestations, you need to imagine yourself inhaling and sending healing light to the base of your spine. Now, since every worry is a prayer drawing to you, that which you're worrying about you need to notice and you need to replace those worries with prayers and with affirmations so you need to call upon your angels to boost your faith to boost your confidence which are two really quite magical ingredients in conscious manifestation so um please do try to um, locate the base chakra please do try to do a little bit of meditation to try and bring those positive thoughts into your life so that the universe can bring you the positive that you wish to have clear yourself this is about asking the angels to release any toxic energies that you may have absorbed and when i'm speaking about toxic energies we get them from people who are around us we get them from ourselves we get them from many different places so this message is coming to you because the angels they see that you're carrying some lower energies and because of your high sensitivity and your compassion maybe you've absorbed this negativity from other people's fears so you need to see the shield you need to see actually the shield okay as if you're shielding yourself for guidance okay this is what you need to look for you need to look for ways to protect yourself from this tendency of attracting um, and absorbing these toxic energies now these toxic energies they may have sprung from your own past fears your present fears regardless of any material source your angels they want to help you clear your energy field so it could be a really good idea to ask for angelic clearing and whenever you've experienced harsh situations where arguing intense competition violence substance abuse has occurred well as a sensitive light worker you sometimes unwittingly carry others painful energy and um, it's a well-intentioned desire to be helpful, but you need to ask those angels to shoulder this pain from now on as they are equipped to handle all of this toxicity without harming. So please, let's be ready to clear and then let's follow what you need to do to move on to your path, to clear yourself, to remove the blockages, to remove the weight upon your shoulders. 
Um, so please, to do this, call upon Archangel Michael. Uh, call upon him and please ask him to use his divine healing to lift any of those energies of fear and anger or jealousy from your back, from your neck, from your shoulders, and to help you feel that compassion for those who may have sent those lower energies your way to be divined and to be healed by that divine love. You need to listen to your feelings also, okay? This is about listening to your intuitive feelings. Very important at all times. That little gut, that little nudge that you receive, it's important. It's your soul speaking to you. Your body is receiving accurate messages from the divine, but you need to hear them. You need to accept them. Your angels, they want you to know that you're always, but always receiving divine messages, even when you're not noticing them. So most of these messages, they come through your physical and your emotional senses. And as your body is just extremely sensitive to all of these different type of energies, sometimes you may not understand your feelings, yet they ha are and always have been quite accurate. So you've received this message because you've asked a question that your body has already answered. Your body's answered the questions, whatever it is that you're wondering upon through your emotional and your physical feelings. Now you are urged to trust your feelings and to act upon them, but without any de delay. Ask the angels to protect you, to guide you, and they are going to do that through your intuitive sensations. So as you, um, as you, you begin this healing, as you remove all of these blockages, you're going to be receiving all of this beautiful angelic guidance because you're always feeling, you're always thinking, and those are two primary ways in which the angels give you messages. So let's move on over to vacuum fear away. And here we go. Now, message coming through here is to call upon your Archangel Michael and Raphael to lift any fear-based energy from you, from your surroundings, from the situation altogether, and everybody who is involved. Now, you receive this message because you, or maybe somebody who is close to you, have absorbed some energies of fear. Now, they could have been self-generated from your own foreboding or Maybe they even came from being fearful with a different type of people. Whenever you feel tired or you have been subjected to any type of, uh, of abuse, you need to take the time to cleanse any residential, uh, not residential, but any residual um, energies. And you can conduct this process anytime or anywhere, even when other people are nearby. Now, this is about removing all of these toxic energies. It is asking for Archangel Michael, Archangel Raphael to lift and to heal your soul, to heal your heart. Lift the weight away. Clear the crown chakra and suction away any toxic fear-based or entity energy that might be with you. And this does complete this reading. I do hope that you enjoyed. Um, so we did we did talk a lot about your chakra, um, about cleansing, about clearing, removing blockages, about moving on forward, removing anything that might be toxic within your, your world right now and listening to your intuitive feelings because your angels are sending you messages through your gut feeling. So um, that being said, this does conclude this reading. I do hope that you enjoyed it. I do hope that you will take the um, guidance coming from the angels today and you'll be able to use it. If you would like to contact me, please do so. All of my information is right below into the YouTube description box. If you have not yet subscribed to the channel, please do click onto the subscribe button and have yourself the most beautiful day. I thank you for being there and I will see you tomorrow with new messages. Many blessings to you.